one-timer, didn't see him there, and so his shot is blocked. Now he centers in as he'll come back around the boards for Moser. Shoot, save is made, the puck is still loose, and finally, Chamruk able to grab on for the face-off as now we got a fight here. Who is this? And they go down to the ground, it looks like it was Melvin and Slack involved in that. and Ty White taking exception for his teammate. He didn't like the way he was hit, and he's dropping the mitts. White with some uppercuts. It looks like now a big right as he's got, it looks like Moffitt. Yes, it is, in fact, Jack Moffitt. And here we go. Gloves are down, and we've got our first fight of the season as Gagne takes down Foster. Out down is Fournier. So is Remy Gagne. Icing waved off as Gagne gets there ahead of the play. Gagne tries to sweep it out in front. Good stick by Pundik to keep it in behind the net. They battle for it. Out with it is Soloway. Nathan Gagne comes in and he takes a penalty. And now we've got everybody coming in. Gagne is throwing punches here. Junior Senators, the home team here tonight at the home of the Castleman Vikings. Powerhouse in the EOJHL. And it's a nice ring, too. Off the draw, Lozier. Oh, here we go. Got a fight. Ottawa scored, but Coops and Windsor will change. Oh. Blows in a big right by Jacob Windsor. Drops Coops to the eyes. One for holding. <laughs> yeah, you got to so. call that one. I guess so. Good call. Wow. Cornwall now working back to the point. Riche. Oh, whoa. And they're going at it pretty good right here. Yeah. As Verdoni getting a few in the face. So that's Kay Stuthers and Verdoni. Several times. Yeah, those trying to get hurt now would be at home, I think, as well. Uh, huh? Yeah, it is uh, so early with uh, 55 games, and we're only about 15 in, but this is going to break loose here. You can see this coming. Yeah, as the buzzer goes, a little pushing and shoving, and uh, probably a frustrated Lumberton team. But they had a very good effort tonight, so uh, Pembroke and. Uh, yeah, once they got that little scrum in behind the net, is. Uh, Although it didn't deserve a whistle, it almost needed to have one to get them away from each other because, you know, nothing good was going to come out that. Still, uh, a, well, we're going to have a fight here, so we're going to have a player miss a game next week. Eli Dugard Wood 
couple of big boys going out of here as he's pounding on the Pembroke player. I don't know if... Uh, up on the wing. Back to Montroy. Oh, geez. Full of tricks, this guy. Montroy again tries to go shelf daddy, and that's picked up by Aiden Oh, Gould. oh! Couple of shots thrown there. Oh, nice feed. Oh, Tallman coming in to defend Montroy. Oh, good. Whoa! Wow. And Kobe Tallman just introduced himself to his right fist and uh that's what you call backing up we've been a long time seeing this yep. for the cornwall colts now they finally get it down the ice over in the far corner schultz through the middle look out as there's a collision at center between bedard and jelena fella goes out to play the puck and here we go jelena along with a bear in a fight. Actually, that's Remy Gagne, excuse me. And now we have more pushing and shoving on this side. Kirk picks up the puck. Kirk trying to get in there. What a hit! Head over heels and a penalty coming up here. And now we've got, oh boy, look out. Here we go. Dorial in, in, in the corner, and punches are being thrown. Dorial rips the helmet off. Look out. He takes a couple of punches, and down he goes. Well, there's Brownlee throwing punches. And this will be interesting, to say the least. And it all started with Jackson Kirk getting sent head over heels by Foster, who went low on him. I didn't think it was low. That's just me. We've got Foster and Tolman paired up here as things get a little nasty after this one. Tallman and Foster once again, and Tallman on top of Foster now. Gives it right back, though. Over the line. Now, look, oh, we got a fight right in front of the penalty box. Tossing uppercuts there is Hamadi. Hamadi just decking Legault with uppercut after uppercut. Three for a dollar. A big no no. And now it's out here, Martinello mixing it up. And McCrate, who really got a lot of the stuff going, McCrate gets the, the better of him at the beginning, but now he's on top of him. Things are getting heated now. Front Shipley able to make that huge save. Well, it could have been a big hole if you're the junior senators. This one's going to be knocked down the length of the ice as Windsor and Riccardi. Hey, look at this, look at him, here we go. Riccardi and Windsor inside the zone. Both guys trying to throw some rights here, over top with the right. Riccardi trying to go back with the right hand. Now Windsor with a big right hand. Riccardi with the right as they go down hard to the ice. Linesman in there trying to separate the two. Hides it back to the blue line. Spec Meek to Ganya. Heavy hit there at center ice as Bowen caught with his head down there by Brandon Walker. Going to track him down is Martin. And looks like Martin and Walker will go here. Walker gets the helmet off of Martin. They're throwing bombs still. Martin immediately jumping off the bench, going right after Walker. He knew this was coming. 
And the Lionies will come in and break this one up. Hit on Reed in the corner. And Reed gives it right back to him. Tanner Fennel with it at center to Merritt. And we get a fight here between Liam Reed and Carter Vallette. Those two were going at it pretty good. And then they dropped the mitts right there. There's a floater to the uh, net area of Randall Snow, but no harm, no foul. McCrate doesn't like it. Here we go, we got a foul. Fight, the mitts are off. McCrate. McCrate wrestles his man to the ice. And I believe that is Spencer Gallant, so two big boys. Who's got no stick? Shot from Caulfield. That's push aside. Big battle in front there with Duck. Now Henry comes over. And uh, deep, uh, pardon me, uh, Nathan uh, Gandhi comes in. So now Nathan Henry, uh, Nathan uh, Gandhi drops his gloves and he's pumping the rights to Duck. Duck gives him right back to him. So Nathan Gandhi, in, in defense of his brother, Ramey Gandhi, didn't like what uh, Duck was feeding to his brother, comes over and drops his mitts and feeds the rights to Nathan Duck. side. Utero chomps it for James Taylor. How to avoid the check of ball. Now we, now we got push and a shot into the Ottawa's out. Now we got punches being thrown. Now we got to fight Bullock as Utero takes him down to the ice with right hands. Bullock comes back to him on the back of Utero who tries to tackle him to the ice and then Brendan Steven the linesman takes down Andrew Utero. Oh my goodness. Bollett still going after Utero. He's grabbing the jersey of Utero as Bollett. Carries it to center. Moffitt into the attacking zone, driving left wing side. Will slide it to the net. Biro out to play it. Here is Rabner. Moffitt tied up with another man. We got another fight here. Merritt. Right hands on to Moffitt, and then Moffitt with another right hand, straining over the top, and I'll back over the top to the left of Merritt. Both of them drawing at him. Moffitt takes Merritt down to the ice with right hands to the head of Merritt. That's the second fight tonight. John, come in and make that play on him. Melvin. Zone exit doesn't work. Melvin got dumped on the end boards. That's going to draw a crowd. Canadians take a penalty. We'll see if Kempfield can maintain discipline not to take one themselves. As Kinlock, Varga, and Coleman Bennett are absolutely mixing it up. Looks like they might drop them. Yeah, they're going to go. Coleman Bennett and Kinlock, Varga. Sizing each other up. Bennett throws a right and another right. Varga trying to find his balance. Bennett ripping him. As Varga coming back a little bit and a good tilt from Kinlock Varga and Coleman Bennett. Oh, Here we go, we go, scrap at the front. <laughs> and it's the Ottawa Junior Center is just oh. having a way as Liam Lucas. Wow. Liam Lucas and Dominic Martin. Here comes Gallant. Foster, a good stick there on Gallant as the two number sevens come together. And Foster all over Gallant. We're going to get a fight here between Gallant and Foster. Oh my goodness. Both of them swinging away at each other. At the far end, Nick Foster and Spencer Gallant. And Foster takes Gallant down to the ice. And the Breckford Braves will take on the Pembroke Lumber Kings on the road on Sunday night at 7. Final minute of play here in the third. And we get another fight here. It's Liverman and Stanitz, and they are going at it hard here. 
Oh my goodness, and Stanitz takes down Liverman to the ice. But a good job to get out of the way there. Powers gets pushed to the wall, and now we've got more pushing and shoving. Belsterling and Kraft. Kraft drops the gloves, and we've got a tilt here. Belsterling against Kraft. They're throwing haymakers. Kraft with an uppercut. He dummies him again, and Belsterling down to the ice. A great tilt here at the Memorial Center. Now Dennis might want to go here with Powers. Powers and Dennis, we got a double dip here. Powers throwing rights. Dennis gets taken down. Call it one each for these two teams. We've had two tilts here at the Memorial Center on billet night. Hilfiger gets body. He met off the interception around the net and then gets taken out by Possumus. And that's going to be a penalty. And it's going to be a cross check. And now a late shot by Jack Boffin onto Possumus. And we got some rough stuff going on here. And now Boffin and Hilfiger are going to drop the gloves here. Punch to the right face from Moffitt to the face of Hilfiger. He's getting an uppercut by Moffitt, who comes across. Now right hand from Hilfiger. Moffitt trying to hang on to Hilfiger. Hilfiger takes Moffitt down to the ice. Right. Puck is loose in the low slot. McIntosh is down. Puck thrown towards the net, and BMAC has got it somehow. Clark is in the middle of four, and having grads and two line spins. Duga, one, and Cognier are gonna go! Gagne with the left, Duga, one, with the right. This one works the face. Gagne trying to throw him down low. Duga, one's pounded on from the top. This one around, Dawson Dolan. Gagne's helmet is off. Duga, one, throwing a couple haymakers. Gagne's got them all tied up, and down they go. Larkin, one of the, again, all the all-rookie team. The Pian has the puck. Larkin goes to, oh, Von Scheidt hits him. Oh, that's not a real good hit. Here comes somebody up now, Papano, and Von Scheidt's just pummeling him. Big difference in size here. I'll give Papano credit. Oh, there's a bad, there's a, oh, it was, when it was all over there, Von Scheidt with a bit of a, I believe, a late punch. He hustles to try to dislodge the puck. Bounces into the slot again. Barrett this time moves up and we have a fight behind the play. Hammerty pulling the left hands to somebody behind the play. The, the first thing you do in the last game of the year is look at the clock. So uh, you don't want any of your suspensions. But, uh, we're only in the second period. We've got lots of time. Now here's Bandu. Drops it back. And a fight. Here's Vom Scheidt. Vom Scheidt feeding Clark. Vom Scheidt absolutely destroys Clark. Take it away with the last 10. The Ottawa Junior Senators are 2023 Bulgar Cup champions for the fourth straight season.